Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is going to be how fast can our Lego EV3 robot go here on Brick Program. So, in, in other words, how many miles per hour? So right now, if you want to pause and put your answer in the comment section, how many miles per hour do you think our Lego EV3 robot can go just on Brick Program? So I know that in... Uh, you know the Mindstorm software we can bump this up to a hundred percent right now on brick program this would be at seventy percent so basically we're just trying to be able to convert uh, today how many miles per hour can our robot go so here's what I have and this is our experiment got a little starting line here I have this going on for one second and I actually put a stop at the end um, because if you don't put a stop it kind of like drifts for a little bit longer but I noticed too that when you put a stop there's a little bit of a kickback which means it stops and it kind of backs up so today's answer is not gonna be completely you know spot-on accurate but we're gonna be able to get a ballpark figure so here we go I'm gonna run this for one second and then we're gonna mark where this ends up I might do this a couple of times just to get I don't know, an average, but here we go. Okay, so I'm gonna mark this right there. And you know what, I might do this actually um, with rotations just to get an, another better idea, but here we go. So I'm gonna put that right there. I look, it's looking almost similar. Let me try it one more time here. I'm gonna make sure this paper does not go here while I'm doing this. Okay. So you know what I might do? I might just take this middle uh, measurement there. Okay, let me switch this um, now to figure out how do we convert that. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and mark a line and measure that so I'll be back okay I'm back and I'll let you see this this is actually pretty pretty accurate because I did this yesterday just to kind of test it out before and I'm getting pretty much this almost the same distance so let me get that in focus there that looks like 11 and 5 8 Yesterday I was getting 11 and 3 fourths, so eh, for the sake of argument, we're going to say 11 and 5 eighths. Oh, let me write that as a fraction. And then I'll, I'll convert that to a decimal uh, in a second here when I do the math. So our robot can go 11 and 5 eighths inches in one second. So I will put on my math hat and we will figure out now how far is that in miles per hour. I'll meet you at my desk. Okay, so you're at Mr. Hino's math desk here where I swap hats and we're gonna do everything mathematically here. So we got 11 and 5 8 inches, which I convert to 11.625 and that would be inches um, in one second. So now let's go ahead and convert that. How would that be for a minute? So if we have 60 seconds, now let's go ahead and convert that to what that would be for a minute. So I'm gonna be back. I'll just multiply 60 by 11.625. Okay, I'm back. I multiplied 60 uh, by 11.625 and I got 697 and a half inches. So if we let this robot go for a minute, it would travel 697 and a half uh, inches. Now what I wanna do is I wanna now convert and go higher and higher until we can get this miles per hour. So I'm now going to, multi I'm sorry, I'm gonna divide uh, 697.5 inches and get that into feet. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back again. So I divided the 697.5 inches by 12, and I got 58.125 feet. So in 60 seconds, it will travel 58.125 feet. 
Now what we want to do is multiply this 58.125 by 60 so we can get that hour. I'll be back. Okay, so reviewing or backing up to see what I did, I figured out how far we can go in 60 seconds. I multiplied this number by 60 to figure out how far this robot would go in an hour. So if we ran this robot for an hour, it would go 3,487.5 feet. So we already know that this does not go one mile per hour because a mile is 5,280 feet. So let's go ahead and get it to a decimal to figure out exactly how many miles per hour this is going to be. So basically what I'll end up doing is dividing the 3,487.5 feet by 5,280 and then we'll get that decimal. Last time guys, I'll be back. Okay guys, last time I'm back. Here we go. So if we were to break it down now by miles per hour, our robot can go 0.66 miles per hour. So just a, you know over a half a mile an hour or a little bit above that. So I don't know what you guys thought. I mean it, it kind of kind of was what I was expecting. I mean it doesn't go super fast. Um, but there you go. If you ever wondered how many miles per hour can our Lego Mindstorms EV3 robot go? There it is. 0.66 miles per hour. All right, guys, hopefully you had fun with the math and experimenting there. You can try it out yourself and tell me what you guys get if you get almost maybe the same thing. All right, I am Mr. Hino from Mission's Lego Robotics. Happy summer to you guys. I am out.